Good evening everyone and welcome back to another episode of Eating with Life Stoke and today we're going to be trying the next pepper. Why do you keep picking this tool. one up and then not doing it? <laughs> yeah, let's do that one. <clears throat> so this was supposed to be Thunder Mountain Longhorn. What is it? I don't know if you notice anything different about this in a Thunder Mountain Longhorn. What would you expect? That it would be long. Yeah. And it is. It's quite long. Yeah. But it's also quite thick. Okay. Thunder Mountain Longhorns are really skinny. Okay. And bumpy. So what's it? This is a Thunder Mountain Longhorn crossed with something. What it's crossed with? Anyone's guess. We don't even have any clues because Thunder Mountain Longhorn is red. This is also red. I can see that. Even if it was crossed with a yellow pepper, it would still be red. So we've got no idea. Oh, so what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to grow our seeds from this to find out. And hopefully take a guess. And hopefully this is a delicious pepper. Because, quite frankly, so far... They've been a bit rubbish. Yeah, they've been a bit hit and miss. More miss. A bit Anyway, miss. this is a lovely looking pepper. I absolutely love it. It reminds me of some of the space peppers that people have been growing. Oh, okay. Know I'm on no. But anyway, let's get into it. Let's cut this open. Oh, right away. It smells of nothing. It smells of absolutely nothing. It smells of water. Smells like um, grass. <laughs> Looks bad. There are a lot of bad seeds in there, that's interesting. Maybe it's an interspecific cross. Going up to the camera and have a look. Uh, we can, even though it's the only thing in this on the screen. There we go. Yeah, that's what we're dealing with here. It's pretty standard. Um, I'll cut it in half and then rip the seeds out. Okay. There you are, there's your piece. What if it's hot? It might be. Thunder Mountain Longhorn has a tiny bit of heat. Is it? It's very sweet. Is it? Oh, and it's very hot. Oh, it smells hot. I didn't like it. It's too hot. It smells like, uh, <laughs> not bad, huh? It's nice and sweet, but then it's just a, it's just a little bit too hot. You'd probably find it fine. Mmm. That's delicious. Oh my god. Yeah, it's nice and sweet. Mmm. Mmm. But then it's a bit hot, hot, hot. It is quite hot. Yeah. Mm. I would say it's like a jalapeno level heat. Maybe a little bit higher. I think seeds for this were sent to me by Amadea. Mm -hmm. um, he was also growing a few of the space peppers. Mm -hmm. So it could have crossed with the space pepper. Mm -hmm. um, I think I'll definitely grow this next year. This is delicious. The heat kind of builds a little bit. Yeah. But not like too intolerable. No. It's perfectly snackable. And it's got a nice taste. Mm. Nice taste. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I'm a big fan of that. It's quite good. Mmm. We found one that we both like. Oh. It never happens. No. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's very sweet. It's like, it it's sweeter than any of the peppers that we've had today. Yeah. And we've had some jalapenos. But aren't that sweet? I no, don't know why everyone's like, it's sweet. It's not. Like, have you had any other peppers? <laughs> have you ever had any sugar in your life? <laughs> have you ever had a piece of fruit? This is this is as sweet as a piece of fruit. This yeah. This is as sweet as like an apple. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a big fan of that. I'll eat another piece. Do you want a piece? Sure. 
Yeah. Tastes quite, quite fruity. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's hot. <laughs> it is hot. Mmm. Oh, Jesus. It's quite hot. I guess it's got that kind of flavour from the Thunder Mountain one. I've never had one, but people have said that they've tasted kind of ornamental, but also kind of sweet. Mm, don't like it. Don't you? Hot. Too hot. It's too hot for you, but the next generation might be not as hot. That's nice just flavor. the way things too go. Hot. Too hot, too hot. Mm-mm, yuck. See, I find it quite nice. I think it's too hot. I'm going to have the whole rest of this. You're crazy. Mmm. Mm. The scent of the pepper, it tastes like a good sweet apple. It is nice and sweet. Mm. I just, yeah, I think it's just too hot for me to just eat. If it was cooked into something, maybe. See, for me, it's like the perfect snack in level heat. It's kind of building a little bit. Not too much, though. Mm. That'd be good in a stir fry, it would add some sweetness to a stir fry. Hmm. But yeah, that took the heat to right at the edge of tolerable for me. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my nose is quite runny, but all in all, very good. Very surprised at how good that pepper was. Very sweet. Hurts, but yeah. It does hurt a little bit. It was definitely like a sweet fruit. Yeah. And the mouth, the, the burn the is mouth. like... The burn's like all over my mouth. Yeah, it's on the roof of my mouth. Mm, yeah, it's quite on the roof of mine as well. Quite harsh. Good though. Mm. I really enjoyed that. Smell you later, pepper lovers. Is that better? Yeah. Why is there expanding foam under our stuff? What the fuck? Who did this?